be making basics. What's going on YouTube, Be Making Basics, back again with another dope video. If you're new to my channel, go ahead and subscribe and give me a thumbs up. But without further ado, let's jump right in. Now today we're gonna be making a dope Drake sample using stock sounds from Logic and using free plugins, okay? So I'm not gonna be using any plugins that you have to pay for or any sounds that you have to pay for in this video. So let's go ahead and jump right in. I got my musical typing up and I also created a software instrument track and I just went ahead and went with a default patch and I'm over here in the sound library, okay? So for you, those who are new, you hit that plus sign, hit software instrument track um, and then go to under instrument and just default, okay? And then you push create. But um, yeah, let's just see what we can come up with. I'm thinking about going with like a piano to start it off and then we'll go from there. Now the first way to get a sample going, I believe is come up with a dope like bass line. And I know saying bass line, you know, you would normally want to do something with like an actual bass guitar, but I'm going to do a piano bass line. So let's just, um, you know, come up with something. So we're going to pretty much just work with something like that. Um, so I'm going to keep on like freestyling this to see what we can come up with. And I'm using a lot of black notes here, so if that helps anybody here. So let's just lay, lay this down. I'm actually gonna slow this uh, tempo down some. I'm gonna start there. bet so we'll start with that this, and I, I like this when it comes to making like a sample you want to just keep things simple you don't want to get too crazy with it because literally you could end up messing things up trying to get too jazzy especially if you're not like a jazz piano player That's perfect, actually. A perfect way to start to sample out. So what I'll do here is we're gonna just extend this like this. I'm just gonna hold down um, option and drag this piano over here and we'll make this like an eight bar. And then what I can also come and do is I can just take one of these and we're gonna drag it in this area right here and we're gonna put it in a quick sampler. And a quick way to like do a little something different is this play it an octave higher. And then what you wanna also make sure you do is put this follow tempo on. Let me put a loop on it. bet so we have the first elements to this sample now the next thing I want to do here is add like a different type of instrument and pre preferably probably like some type of string so what we'll do is um, I'll create another software instrument track do another default patch and I'm gonna see what we got in the uh, studio strings here Thank you. 
right, so we'll do something like that. If you notice, like, really, Drake likes to rap over a lot of emotional sounding beats. You know, so this is going to be an emotional sample here. So what we're going to do now is just go ahead and quantize um, what we just played. We could just do 1 over 16th note. That's fine. We could put a little swing on it. Just swing, putting swing on stuff kind of like helps it feel a little more natural. And I'm going to also do a 1 over 8 since the notes are basic. And if you notice here, the velocity was played different on, on some of these notes. So we're going to fix that. Um, I'm going to go ahead and just... Get this guy right here. We're going to highlight everything by pushing Command A. I'm going to bring everything all the way up to the top and then bring it down some. Just add a little bit of variation on this second part. Bet. So we're going to do it like that. And then to make it all smooth and flow together better, I'm going to go ahead and do what's called Force Legato. I'm going to right click on one of these after highlighting everything and go like that. And it's going to basically bring the notes all the way to the end of each other note. All right, bet. So now this is going to be where we're going to add some effects. Now I could probably start trying to add more to the sample and all that type of stuff, but we want to keep it um, simple, especially when you're using like a sample, you're going to, you know, take the sample, flip it and different things like that. So I'm going to keep it simple. So let's look at what we're going to do as far as adding effects here. Um, I'm going to go ahead and mute the strings. I think I'm going to keep the strings just natural, but what I'm going to do here is go to the piano. And I'm actually going to use an effect called vinyl. It's by Isotope. It's free. Um, you can actually get it on Isotope's website. So that's a free plugin that you can use for this. And what I want to be doing is using this warp. And what that warp is going to do is kind of give it that detune vibe on it, kind of like some lo fi vibes. So let's just check out how that sounds.
And we could give it some electric feel to it, like do that if you wanted to. A little mechanical feel. We're just gonna take it, hold down the option and drag this on over. We'll just put this on everything, really. Only thing I don't like is that it was just doing too much having that um, electric feel in there like basically like white noise and stuff in there just doing too much let's listen to the sample now with everything on it all right so sounds pretty dope it sounds a little bit um vintage some other things we could do to make it sound more vintage is just go ahead and eq it some i can just take off a little bit of the highs Roll some of those off. We'll go ahead and turn that metronome off since we're not recording right now. And roll some off on that, that the strings as well. We'll play it together. All right, bet. So pretty much after we got that um, going, what I could do is I can just kind of copy it, like not kind of copy and paste this. I'm just going to join this right here first, and then we can copy and paste this mm, two times. Let's drag it off like that. And then I can just make this joint build. So push control M to mute this out. And then now this is going to be the end of our sample right here. And what I would do here is I'm going to highlight everything and I'm going to push, uh, I'm just going to right click and we're going to bounce it in place. And we're just going to say like Drake sample. Bet. So what that did when I bounced this in place, it just took everything that you heard right here and it's now turned it into a whole sample right here. So um, so now we can just take this and it has already it has the effects on it. I can just drag this into our quick sampler and we can just chop this sample up however we want to um, and, you know, redo the sample, play it a different you know, keys and all types of stuff. So we can reverse it. Uh, this all right, 
instantly made some some fire once she reversed it. some stuff like that um, you can keep it um, going forward and you can just maybe play it a different octave you can come over here and now speed it up we can speed up this uh, the project here say the 140 You know what I'm saying? You got a whole lot of vibes that we can create, we can do off this beat. And I'll probably go ahead and flip this sample, but I'll do it in another video. But y'all, thank you so much for watching. Again, make sure you go to my site, Be Making Basics, grab a course or two, grab some sound packs or two. And then also, if you don't do anything else, make sure you go ahead and subscribe to the channel. And then also, you can go to the site to get in or get a ticket to get in our 100K subscriber giveaway, okay? And how this 100K subscriber giveaway works, on our journey to 100,000 subscribers, we're gonna be giving away real live prizes, okay? Um, we're gonna be doing this at different milestones. So like the first milestone is at 10,000 subscribers. We're almost there, we're only a few thousand off. So like once we get to 10,000, we're gonna be giving away a pair of studio headphones, all right? Um, so make sure y'all leave in the comments like, yo, what kind of studio headphones do you think we should get for this giveaway? Um, and then make sure you also go ahead and download the 100K um, subscriber pack, okay? It's only five bucks and it also comes with sounds and tutorials in it. So, you know, you're getting hella value plus you're getting entered into the 100K giveaway to win something dope. But um, anyway, thanks for watching. I'll see you in the next video. Peace.